Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Speedy Recovery, um, where we have now managed to uh, build cloud computing. I've also made um, some templates of these rooms now. We've got this doctor. Um, I need him to work in both. Not sure I've done that. Um, no, there we go. So he can now work both of those. This uh, hospital's a little bit messy, isn't it? A little bit messy. Um... But we're just trying to rake in some cash, aren't we? We're just trying to rake in some cash. Um, and I think that uh, getting uh, the hive mind going uh, will, will really help with that. Uh, we could do, really, with getting through more of these. Um, I'm wondering... Uh, I'm trying to calculate what would be uh, the next uh, best thing for cash injection into the into the hostel. What did we do to you? Oh, oh, is the oh, is the all foundation lady in? Oh, she is. Look, a quick cash injection. But look, look what's happened here. So, with 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 all of a sudden all of this cash, right? Let's uh, let's change things a bit. So, for example, we are going to upgrade this, right? We have the money has uh, got better quick. It's going to upgrade that. Um, okay. Now we need to get three trained in flying, so we're just going to stick in that other chair. Now, now then, now then, now then, now then, we have some driving staff. They are a researcher as well, so probably not going to invest in them. Um, in fact, I'm not entirely happy with a lot of these. Ooh. Right. Kimmy? Are you ready for training? I don't know. No, she's not ready for training. That's annoying. Still, uh, she is a doctor as well. Also quite annoying. But better than I don't know I don't really want to invest in right you could train in flying right flying that's right yeah look insist landing is just like taking off but backwards which is why she only teaches one of them <laughs> okay fine um so anybody mm, mm, uh, uh, uh. fine um to get it done just to get it done there we go fine whatever whatever I'm not they're not perfect Don't we get upset about this okay well there's that now next we could uh, oh my goodness you at least get one of those in oh my goodness <laughs> Look at this! Amazing! I want to see this thing in action! Let's uh, balls to the wall. Buy two of them. Nurse to the ward, <laughs> My goodness! Right, some rep. That's always nice. Uh, right, we should be looking at more diagnostic, shouldn't we? Um, that would be good, actually. That would be good. So we can actually treat more of these patients. Because you know what's going to happen in one of these stars. It's going to be saying, well, we need to do better with actually successfully treating them rather than them just knowing they're going to die and send them for treatment. They die. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I'm working on these things right now. Um, but we do need to be diagnosing Doctor this better. Um, with the GP office situation. Um... Where is, is this is Rowena is our uh, GP. So what we could do is get Rowena after this, uh -oh, oh, she was trapped there. Once this training is done, um, we can, oh look, she's got goggles on and everything. Look at her. This is amazing. This is amazing. So um, once this training is done, we will see about uh, getting some GP training done. Um, and we need to start looking at uh, nurse diagnostics. Uh, that would be good. Um, and just try and sort out the drivers a little bit. I don't know. I'm a bit upset about the driver situation because, yeah, it'd be nice to get them in some diagnostic training, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would be. 
Okay, so we've got an earthquake coming, which is not the best. Oh, you know what? Staff room. <laughs> I'm going to build that. Definitely going to build that. There we go. That'll, that'll help get staff back to work faster, which we like. We like we like that. It's getting a bit chilly there, isn't it? It is getting a bit chilly there. Oh, and we haven't... Oh, I haven't put... This is still hot. Okay, let's get that fixed. Good. Yeah, this is a little bit... I think what we'll do is we'll pop this over here for now. There we go. Right. 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 Yeah, so we'll sort GP training out. But we've got diagnostics we need to look at. This is all a bit over the place, isn't it? They're all just a bit all a bit messy. So we have a nice clean doctor here. So if we have a look at our current doctors. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Don't really have any need for a good clean doctor at the moment in terms of this. It's a bit frustrating. Bit frustrating. It is. Oh, look, that training is done. Right, okay, with that training done then, let's get you going now. I, don't, I probably don't want to do it that way, do I? Uh, typically, though, nobody has. There's nobody to hire with diagnostic training. Let's get rid of Jade here. Typical, typical. Right, okay, but maybe we could look at diagnostics here. I mean, not the best, but a start. We just need to get something going, don't we? We need to get something going. So, you, you, okay. Quite a lot of drivers, quite a lot of drivers. This driver here would have been good as a flyer. Do you know what we'll do? Get get them trained up. I think I would like them tra trained in flying. They look like a good one to keep around. We'll get you to do it. Right, okay. I've got a plan there. It may look confusing, but there's a plan working there. Um, we need diagnostics. Okay, but didn't I just hire somebody for this and I've instantly forgotten? Yeah, was it you? Might have been. Yeah, might have been them. Right, out of the diagnostic rooms for nurses, let's see. Um, I like the idea of fluid analysis, I think. So we might pop that in, right? Oh, I can't get it, can't get it, so we'll... Pop this in here and um, build that. Yes. Benny in over here. And then we've got just a little bit of extra diagnostics. Because that's been a problem. That has been a problem. Probably have to look at the janitors again soon. Trying to keep hold of this other helicopter. So desperate to keep hold of it. Um, right, so we've, got, we've expanded diagnostics a little bit, tentatively, um, and we need to we need to cut down on expensive stuff. Right, this is something we need to do. So Kimmy here will be able um, to do some driving, but I think what I need to do is sack this member of staff. Very expensive. And we've got the majority of this done for now. I can always get somebody else later cheaper. So I think once this training is done, I'll sack them. Successfully diagnosing these chaps is uh, really important. Top of the list at the moment for this one. Because this is just money. This one is a bit more than money, isn't it? So now then, a doctor with no GP training... Doesn't do much at all. Going to fluid analysis. Okay. 
I need to see about getting um, these machines upgraded as well. Um, now, it feels like it's been a while since we've done this. So, we can now dispatch somebody over to here. Some individuals are suffering from something at this location, probably. <laughs> so, we'll go and check on that. Let's send somebody over to here. Get those in. Let's send somebody over to there. Yeah. Okay. Let's see this go, shall we? Here we go. Are we ready, everybody? Are we ready? I am. I'm so excited. Oh. <gasps> I love it. Oh, look at it go. <laughs> Brilliant. Right. The answer was water resistant bassoon. I'm hoping to make fun <laughs> trivia like okay. that a regular part of my show. Thanks, Wolf. If you enjoyed it, get in touch to let us know by writing a letter or using a phone with one of those rotary dials that we oh, still, we still have. don't have any. At this rate, I am actually going to have to pay for some proper GP training, aren't I? Oh, look. Oh, Center for Treatment. We haven't quite got there, have we? Okay. Uh... Do you know what? It'll just bump that up more and increase our chances. We could do with researching, actually. So do I sack him or do we research? Maybe we should research this first. Explore options to improve treatment for hive mind. Yeah, maybe we should do that. Do that. Do that. I really want to train this GP cheaply. But it's having none of it. It's actually having none of it. This doctor is really appealing. Can't believe this. Uh, we could spend some money on upgrading that. Right. Best we can do. So go. You. I'd like to get you to recharge super fast. Super fast. In our okay staff room. It's just an okay staff room. Nothing crazy, just okay. Um, good. Right. Um, there's one. Now, what we're going to have to do is something expensive. <laughs> but, train you GP with them. Good. Um, oh, we also have another student doctor here. She might be able to train up sane research so that they're cheaper, right? Yeah, so that we can slowly put this, this dude here out of work. <laughs> <laughs> you've been magnificent, but... And you've gained some new training from it, so, you know, doing well. Uh, but this hospital is struggling, mate. We just can't afford you. <laughs> just can't afford you. Don't know what to say. Don't know what to say. Off it goes, off it goes, bring in the patients. Oh. Cyclonic irritation. Brilliant. Okay, nausea and dizziness caused by whirlwinds. Um, patients report that it really winds them up. Very good. Injection room gets the job done, um, which we have. It's the good thing about these types of rooms, you know, when they, they treat multiple illnesses. No extra cost. We are treating more people. It's the best. It's the best. It's the best way to do it. it really is. We're killing them en masse in here. Um, even even with all this. Um, come and get some rest. Try not to slip in the sick. In the sick. Always good advice. Let's get them out of here. It was a fun time. It's for the real problematics at the moment. Good. Oh, look, we did that one. Never going to do that, are we? What else have we got here? Ooh. What's this one? We could give that a go. Give that a go. Um, okay, lovely. Thank you. What? What? Mime crisis. Um, what is this? Psychiatric. Send them home. 
I can't take that on board right now. I can't. I'm concentrating on hive mind, right? My money's going into hive mind right now, which is going to be diagnostics and training. Yeah. Um, right. Can you pay attention, please? This is very serious stuff. It's very serious stuff. Now, we're going to have two doctors. Um, so what we'll do is we'll get them, I think, afterwards to train Rowena so that we can keep all this going. All right, be able to keep all that going. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be great. So that training is almost, almost done. Almost done. Do you know what we could do? Buy, buy the last one of these. Get that done. There we go. That's it. So we can truly concentrate on hive mind. Oh, oh, this training. So... Brilliant. Come on. There it is. So we'd now like you to do this training with them. Good. Excellent. We are pleased. Oh, thank goodness. She's so intensely expensive. Right, fire. My goodness. My goodness. <laughs> oh, we uh, managed to cure another one. Hive mind, that's good. We've sent out for some more uh, patients. We need that cash injection. We do. Now that one needs to go home. Can't do that one. Uh, you're good. Okay. Oh, oh, Pan's lab. Can't do that right now. Okay, but we've got some hive minds going, haven't we? Come on, we can do this. <laughs> It's it's going it's going okay uh, for a hospital. I'm trying to get out of dodgy times. We're actually doing all right here. I think what I'm going to do because I have these two nurses concentrating on all of this. I think we might actually get rid of to save money here them. Okay, now what we need to um, do is uh probably get a researcher well I, I mean i said it before but i, I went with two um, gps in the end but uh we do need um to oh we need to restart that oh my goodness we do need to um yeah get, get a researcher look hygienic so what we might do is pop them in there okay research and then we can get rid of him Right, so just looking at saving money. So we've done some things that will be a cash injection. Now I'm looking at ways of saving money. So we're going over our staff. Oh yeah. There we go. Right, let's now fire him. So this, the doctors are looking pretty clean now, right? Next job is to go over the nurses, see if we can sort this out. Um, I've got quite a lot of janitors. A lot of people are mostly repair and upgrades uh, more than anything else, um, which is working for us. But yeah, we've, we've got some stuff going on here, don't we? Um, and we've now got two drivers, three flyers. So I found this nurse, Vince Rocket apt name for i believe learning to drive so um yep yeah, terry could you train this person in driving See? a nice clean driver here that that will work for us beautifully right it, it's going to work a charm yes got a little bit of cash i'm just going to spend some on getting some upgrades going I like some upgrades um still not ready for this one we're working on it um but we might yeah do that upgrade yeah look this upgrade just get a few upgrades going um because we are starting to get animal magnetism we've got shock treatment here pan we're starting to need clinics right um 
but I need this to be stable. This, For me, this is how it works. I need to have the foundations of the hospital working before I can expand. Otherwise, the wheels will fall off. So this needs to work um, smoothly before I expand. Um, otherwise, yeah, it'll just get worse and worse and worse and the hospital will fall apart. So we need to make this solid. And so that's my focus at the moment. Before we expand too much, make this better. Make this solid and safe. And then we have solid foundations to build upon. And we're still, you know, I mean, we're still getting the job done, right? We're still working towards the first start. So it's not, it's not terrible. And then, um, and like I say, I'm sure there'll be objectives moving forwards on how many we are actually curing. Like successful curing. And, and, then, and that's, you know, then we'll worry about it. But right now, just need this to work. Need it to work. It's amazing. Early mistakes just by me not sending out uh, for emergencies quick enough the impact on the hospital um, it just it's it's quite large it's been going on for quite some time and I'm still not out of the woods from it I'm still sort of paying the price um, you just got to make a lot of sensible decisions and you can pull yourself out of any situation with this game that's that's what I think I like about it is that you can make mistakes but um, you don't need to start over You can most of the time. You can, if you're willing to put in the work, you can generally turn them around. And I always think trying to turn them around, you learn more from that so that you don't repeat mistakes. That's that's So I tend to persevere and struggle with things rather than just saying, right, I'm restarting. Because I, 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 I feel like I learn more. I'm one of these sorts of people that learns uh, through practical... <laughs> Um, examples, right? Rather than theory. Uh, I think theory will only get you so far. Oh, look. We're only two away. We're only two away. Two away. It's happening. It's happening. Oh, we have actually had this driver. So we could probably get rid of this person. And this, look, shall we also get them trained in driving? It looks like they're about to leave, actually. But we could get them trained in driving. I think that's sort of worth it, right? Get them in flying and driving and then go diagnostics. What do we think? Maybe two driving and then diagnostic? No, speed's not a problem. I think we'll go diagnostics, right? Um, yeah, I might, I, might, I might do that. Um, because we're in a situation where we can um, see about getting rid of uh, these here at least one I would say at least one of them a third would be good though right a third would be good and we could do with another nurse to train in driving and flying I think I, that would I'd be more comfortable what I like about this now is that when they're upgrading these machines they stand around right so it takes longer but you can continue to treat. So between patients, they will now work on the upgrade. But then when the next patient arrives, they stand and wait. Uh, and this has not always been the case. So whenever this went in as an update, uh, and I didn't notice, uh, I've noticed it now. And uh, it's, it's really rather great. Uh, I'm a fan, definitely. They're here to water the plants. So here comes the next patient, you see. There they go. They stand and wait. I like that. It does take longer, for sure. But that's the way I'd want it. No, man! Yes! Quick! Employ! <laughs> that is brilliant right there. Norman, you legend. So, yeah, we like Norman. Uh, let's get him into all the driving gear. Now, Norman is also ready for some training. So we can go straight in and get in some flying training. Look at that. So, um, yeah, let's get you in to teach them in flying, which will give us, oh, just, just great selection of, so we can now fire you. Excellent. Look at that. Look at that. So we've got this one, driver and flyer, driver and flyer, driver waiting to train in flying, getting there. Um, and then after this training is done, we can sack Terry. Oh, then we've got then we've got, our, then we've got our driver team, our emergency team sorted. 
which is great. And they're all in their outfits as well. Really, really pleased. Oh, failed that. We are um, still waiting for these two, though. We are still waiting for these two. Um, it is a thing. Oh, come on. Come on. You can do this. I know. I know. We need to start buying other buildings and that. Come on. I mean, we've got two right here, but... Oh, there's one! There is one! Get in, Felix! Get in, Felix! Oh, he's got a lovely hat. Look at that. A fantastic hat. Um, so, who have we got here? Right, Alison. Come on, Alison. Look. 80% chance of cure. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, just sorting out his hygiene. Brilliant. Up those chances. Here we go, here we go, here we go! <gasps> In your own time. Yes! Smash their head in there and we got our first star. <laughs> I understand. You have been investing in air ambulances. Indeed, I can think of no better time for that than the middle of a tropical storm. <laughs> You're right. Uh, please don't expect me to ride any of them. Continue braving the storm or come down to earth and get back to work yours fragrantly tarquin foxbridge oh we've opened up pointy pass and also hive mind poster we want the hive mind poster so let's um let's have a look hive mind poster hive mind poster hive mind poster hive mind poster <laughs> any minute now we'll find hive mind poster that no right okay fine right hive there it is <laughs> <laughs> Right, clearly one of the best pictures. <laughs> this, is <Nigel> <laughs> uh, this is one of the Too best pictures. Go. I'm loving the it. Oh, this is so good. I'm so happy lesson. right now. I'm so happy. Right then, so in the next episode, we can start on our second star. Look, complete upgrade. All of the waxworks research we're already on. Place it second. In emergency responses. Uh, is that, is that what saying? Place at least second in emergency reputation for three months. Okay. Upgrade ten machines. Oh, crying out loud. Oh, mind you, actually, they're, they're all still outstanding. So we're, we're good for that one. And then get our reputation up. With um, expanding uh, to buy uh, new lands and start building all these clinics. Uh, will definitely help with that and we can start cleaning all this up and, and get into training and that we're still we're still trying to sort the nurses out a little bit still a little bit messy around here um what is happening with that training are we oh they were uh, they were out i think they might have been out on an emergency yes but they are coming back so that's fine that's fine that's it terry uh, he's not rushing because he knows that once he's done this training uh he's sacked yeah if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you to all my Patreons for their continued support.